Do you desire to have really long hair? Have you ever experienced stagnancy when you're trying to grow your hair? You still stuck on shoulder length and you need to see some length retention and some gains before you give it up and relax your hair? <laughs> I have the perfect solution for you and it's only going to take us 12 short weeks. So if you're interested, keep watching. Hey you stars, what's good in the proverbial hood? It's your girl Zara, popularly and lovingly known of course as FXR and I'm back with another delectable, delightful, dazzling video. We're going to be embarking on a 12 week challenge to grow our hair at least three inches. Okay, did we cue the dramatic music? Because I know some of you are wondering how exactly we're going to achieve this. Well, I'm going to show you in today's video, sponsored by me, of course because duh. So before we get into it, of course, be sure to thumbs up and let YouTube know that you enjoy this type of content. Comment down below. Let me know if you've ever embarked on this type of challenge before. Share this video with your friends and your loved ones. And last but never ever can be least, please be sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on your notifications so you know every time I post a new video. Don't forget to watch the ads so I can keep the channel extremely sustainable for you. Please and thank you. Okay, without further ado, let's get into it. Here we are in the video. Are you excited? Because I sure am. Now, in order to achieve this three plus inches of growth and finally, finally get past shoulder length, bra length, mid back length, or whatever length plateau you're trying to overcome, we're going to adhere to a few very simple steps. Now, following all of these is extremely important if you actually want to have the most effective journey on this 12 week challenge. I've been doing this for the past two to three years and it's really helped me to make significant gains and it's probably the period within the year where I see the most growth. I know that genetics plays a huge role in how quickly our hair actually comes out of our heads, <laughs> but you can optimize your hair growth externally and internally. So now I know I've whet your appetite enough, <laughs> let me start telling you guys exactly what needs to happen for this to work for us. Now ultimately what you need for this to actually work the right way is an easily accessible protective style, a solid regimen, something that will allow you to keep track of your progress, and high quality products and or recipes. Now let's start with the easily accessible protective style because that's our foundation. I have my trusty Westy notebook, as you can see. Super cute, right? I'm going to just quickly read off what the style is and what the benefits are. I'm actually wearing it in my hair and it happens to be mini braids. Now I'm using those quotation marks because these are not really mini. I like to do medium braids, not small, not necessarily medium, but they would be considered medium on most people's heads. My hair is just really dense. Now the reason why I ensure I do braids for this particular challenge is because braids are extremely easy to wash. They're extremely easy to moisturize. It literally takes no time. You don't have to section your hair or anything. You can very easily reach your scalp. And of course, for those of us who have sensitive skin and sensitive scalps, this is extremely important. You can exercise and easily cleanse your scalp and your hair. They're easy to pop under a wig or pop under some braids or some lock extensions. And you can easily keep the style neat because they're braids. You can easily redo the perimeter or at least the front edges and your part. It's a very long lasting style that can continuously be reimagined in a way that keeps you from getting restless or bored. Now I'm gonna quickly return to washing your hair with braids. If you want to see massive growth in your hair very quickly, you need to make sure that you're cleansing your scalp on a regular basis. This style is super easy to wash. It does not lock up. And you can wash your hair as often as two to three times a week without any kind of stress and very, very little maintenance. For people with sensitive scalps, this is exceedingly important and will allow you to see thicker hair, see better growth, growth that is ultimately not obstructed, more consistent growth, darker hair, better quality hair if your scalp is extremely clean. For me, in this period of winter, or dry season. I'm from Maryland, so like it's really dry in the winters there. And I've always been in dry climates for winter. Of course, I'm in Nigeria right now and it's very, very dry. Washing my hair helps to replenish the moisture. I'm not able to do this when my hair is free because I have to worry about styling, re-moisturizing, sectioning, detangling 
and really a lot of things that are way too much manipulation for my hair on a day-to-day -day basis. But with my hair in braids, I can easily do all of that without <laughs> manipulating my hair pretty much at all. All I'm doing is shampooing, conditioning, and then I pop in my moisturizer. I might sit under the steamer to help my moisturizers penetrate a little bit better, but that's about it. So now that we understand why we've chosen this particular foundation, let's move on to the regimen aspect. Now for the past two to three years, and I've definitely mentioned this in other videos, I have been building the perfect hair regimen and I was able to bring that to you all in a calendar. Now in order to do this method exactly as I do it, you do need to have access to that, but I've given it to you all for just 50% off. It's in the top right corner for your viewing pleasure. Now as far as using my calendar, it gives you the opportunity to have a regimen from Sunday to the following Sunday. It also accommodates weekly treatments, monthly treatments, treatments that occur every six weeks, and I've provided one for each hair type. Low porosity, neutral porosity, high porosity, dry and sensitive and or troubled scalp, and then of course for people who don't like to use oils and butters. If you don't use oils and butters, you can still embark on this particular journey. It really doesn't discriminate, and no matter what your hair type, this journey can actually be really beneficial for you. For someone like me, of course, I have a dry and sensitive scalp and I also have low porosity hair. So I use both of those calendars depending on my needs. What I really love about it is that it allows me to, of course, know what I'm doing with my hair every single day without much thought. For ease and independence, I highly recommend you get that particular product. Here are a few reviews of my digital products from you. Be sure to pause to read. Now, as far as going on this journey together, of course, I will take you along with me. I want to show you guys, again, let me get my trusty Wesley notebook, my weekly routine. That way you know what to do, at least on the surface, right? Just a surface level routine, nothing too crazy. We're not going to get too detailed into the treatments because, of course, they vary from week to week. I'm going to show you how I redo my edges. I'm going to show you how I wash my mini braids, my medium braids, <laughs> so you know exactly how to cleanse your hair and your scalp properly. And truly, you can do this several times a week. And I'm going to show you the extended ways in which I care for my scalp that I can't always do when my hair is free. Now we did discuss planning. I advise you get a notebook tracking exactly what you're doing to your hair. Now if you don't want to get a notebook, if you intend to use my calendar to follow along on this journey, because that's going to be a heavy part of this series, then you have access to the planner which will also be linked in the top right corner. Alternately, you can check out my hair growth bundle that's going to feature all of the recipes we're going to use on this particular journey. So you get my recipe bible, access to my favorite hair products, and of course my planner and the calendar to suit your hair type. I'm already three weeks into this journey and I want to make sure I was going to be diligent before of course bringing it to you all. So we're starting from day one together but I'm really excited because it's as easy as brushing your teeth and it takes the stress out of caring for your hair. Now, if you do want to see this video series pretty much every week, then please drop some green emojis in the comment section down below. Let me know. I'm going to do my best to bring it to you every week. Now, honesty hour, guys. Um, My puppy passed away like a little bit ago. And then my best friend um, from my childhood also passed away. I mean, he still, he was my friend up until my adulthood too, right? So I've been, it's been a bit challenging for me to give you guys exactly what you expect from me, right? But I am grateful to those of you who've been supporting me, even though I'm not as present. Um, ultimately, entering adulthood, I didn't realize, it didn't occur to me that these things would become part of reality. But as we grow older, we encounter the fact that life, at least on Earth, is not permanent. That we are very much mortal, at least in these bodies, right? I'm a Christian, guys, so I believe in an afterlife. But, um, yeah. 
Those heavier topics aside, I'm really excited to do this with you all and I want to hear from you. Like, what do you guys want to see from me as far as this particular challenge? Because I'm definitely keeping my hair like this for the next three months. I don't like to feel like I'm tolerating my hair. So this provides me with some nice respite, which is what's making me so excited about this and doing this with you all. Well, anywho, if you're actually going to join me on this challenge, please, please, please let me know. We can have a hashtag Zara's or epic zara's hair growth challenge 2022 yeah i know it's gonna go into 2023 but let's do it like that that way we can keep track of what exactly we're doing right but um i'm really excited to do this with you all and i absolutely cannot wait thank you so much for watching this video if you made it this far drop some blue emojis down below and i'll see you in the next video in this particular series now don't forget you can get the hair bundle here so that you can easily follow along it's going to make the journey a lot easier for day to day because of course i won't be with you every single day <laughs> so thank you all so much i love you and i'll see you in my next video please say a prayer for me please keep me in your heart please keep my loved ones in your prayers as well you know it's been it's been a bit tough dealing with those but i'm grateful for the gift of life and i'm grateful that i have you to talk to so thank you for being there and i'll see you in my next video